Heavy rain and flooding in the spring and summer usually increases the chances of E. coli or toxic algae contamination in Iowa lakes. The Iowa Department of Natural Resources has already closed one state beach. You can see it here in red and it is not recommending that you swim at four others. Those are marked here in yellow due to water contamination. The beaches you see on this map in blue though are locally controlled. So what if you want to use two popular lakes in the Des Moines area? KCCI's Marcus McIntosh is live tonight at Easter Lake with a look at the water quality there. Steve and Stacy, what we learned today is that Gray's Lake and here at Easter Lake, the beaches here are fine. We spoke with the IODNR who tells us that most state beaches are problem free, which seems to go against what usually happens when heavy rain is followed by flooding, something the DNR finds puzzling. None whatsoever. Roger Bruner is the supervisor of water quality monitoring for the Iowa DNR. He says during the recreational season, state beaches are checked weekly for toxin levels in the water. This year is very typical. We have very low rates of advisories for blue green algae toxins. He says the majority of state beaches are safe despite fears that rain, flooding, and runoff has led to higher than acceptable levels of blue green algae toxins and E. coli bacteria. We really don't have a good answer for that. That's an active area of research as we speak. According to the DNR website, one state beach is closed due to algal toxins and four of the state's beaches are not recommended for swimmers. <laughs> Christine McCormick says she does not necessarily need the DNR website to tell her when it is safe for her family to swim at a state beach. She puts trust in what she can see for herself. No, I haven't had any concerns. I think the water um, today is really, really clear. Clear water aside, overall McCormick has confidence when she gets in the water here in Iowa, she is doing so without a lot of risk as to what could be lurking in the water. Generally, the beaches are pretty safe uh, and pretty clean, and so it's not something that we're overly concerned about in Iowa usually. Watch this. Bruna shares McCormick's confidence and says aside from five state beaches, there's no reason for anyone to avoid the water over concerns about toxins. It's a fun place to be. Water quality at state beaches are currently being tested. Those numbers should be available tomorrow. Now to check those numbers, what you have to do is log on to www.iowadnr.gov, find the environmental protection tab, and then you click on State Park Beach Monitoring. As you see, the water's just fine. I'm Marcus McIntosh, live at Easter Lake. Let's go back to you in the studio.